J.B. Holmes took down Jordan Spieth and Johnson Wagner in a playoff that lasted two holes to claim the Shell Houston Open. That's his fourth career victory. Holmes put together an impressive Sunday 64, but if you ask Johnny Miller, there's one thing this guy cannot do. I'm not sure what he does when he attempts to plumb Bob because he doesn't have a clue of how to do it. He may not know how to plumb Bob, but he certainly knows how to win. Another guy that knows a thing or two about winning, that would be world number one Rory McIlroy, who turns out also knows a thing or two about hitting the gym. McIlroy recently became the first professional golfer to appear on the cover of Men's Health. Check out some of the behind the scenes footage as world number one shows off his vertical and deadlift form. So. Are we still convinced that golfers aren't athletes, people? McElroy also graced the cover of New York Times Magazine, of course, leading up to his attempt at completing the Grand Slam at Augusta this week. Augusta is this week. The Masters starts this week. I can't say that enough times. All right, now on to the best proposal of the week. Keegan Bradley finally popped a big question to his longtime girlfriend, Jillian. Okay, it wasn't the big question, but big enough for now. One of the most fun parts of the Masters is the par three contest, where players replace their usual loopers with their wives, girlfriends, and children. Keegan sent Jillian some beautiful roses to officially ask her to be his caddy. He said yes. Saying yes to the dress is a big deal, but saying yes to the Masters caddy jumpsuit, I think that's even better this week. All right, now on to a longtime caddy that just has really, really terrible luck. Justin Rose's longtime caddy, Mark Fulcher, who goes by the nickname of Fooch, came out of his hotel during the Shell Houston Open to his car missing all four tires. He tweeted out these photos saying, it appears my rental car has lost as many wheels as LFC, that's Liverpool Football Club. Long walk to the course now. Hashtag no wheels on my wagon. Fooch's boss was not going to miss out on an opportunity to have a little fun with the misfortune, sending out this photo on Instagram saying, Team Rose Augusta bound, Fooch 1993, I hope no one has stolen the wheels off the landing gear. That'll do it from the week of the Shell Houston Open, so now let me officially welcome you to Masters Week. We are at Augusta all week long, people. It's the first major championship of the year, so really there is no reason to ever stop smiling all week long. I will see you next week after the green jacket is awarded on Sunday evening.